Hey guys, welcome back to Walk in Your Worth. Um, I just have a quick video to share with you. So this is a prophetic word. God has been urging me for the longest time, like at least a week to two weeks, um, to do this video. And I apologize, I'm dripping wet with water. It is raining heavily outside right now. And that's okay, because God, it just kind of like ties in with this message. Basically what he's saying is that you know, he's going to give the latter rain. And he says, I am, I'm not sure exactly what verse it is. Um, I don't know if it's Isaiah or Jeremiah, so I'll have to find it. I could be way off. But basically, he's talking about asking God for the rain, the spring rain. And it's currently spring right now. So this is just really awesome. And basically, he's talking about he's going to restore, I think it's Israel, so it might be Isaiah. But um, he's going to redo some restoring and he's going to just come in and he's going to do a marvelous work you know like he's just ask he's waiting for us to ask him for the rain and that can be literal or it could be you know metaphorical as far as like the rain in your life whether it be finances or love or it be abundance or whatever it is that you're asking for don't be afraid to ask come to him in confidence and then the other thing that he wanted me to say is this this is the one he's urging me to so i don't know if you can see it it says connect the dots okay so if you can look that's literally start to finish all the way to 10 and it's by some little girl named rose okay so i don't know who rose is but i was actually picking up sticks in the yard after the last storm that we had and for whatever reason i had this gut feeling that i needed to go to the to the left side of the house like i needed to go around it and when I did, there was this photo, or not photo, sorry, this image that was just kind of like chilling up against the side of the house. And I was just like, what is this? Like, you know, like whose trash is in the yard? And so I went to go pick it up and lo and behold, I'm not even kidding. Like I kept seeing dots, dots, dots everywhere all day the day that I saw this. This was again like two or three weeks ago. And I wasn't sure if God wanted me to talk about it or not. Like, I didn't know if it was just for me or if it was for everyone, for the body of Christ. And yes, this is for me and y'all. So anyways, what he's saying is he's doing it. It's already accomplished. If you notice, it's from start to finish, from 1 to 10, and it's finished. You can tell that there was a few, not like mistakes, but just kind of like uncertain spots where it's not quite even and then on number eight it looks like it's barely missed it but yet it's still connected so that's the same thing with our lives this is the decisions that we've made or during this journey of us trying to unite with our kingdom spouses or us trying to get that that job that god's told us to that he either promised us or that we're supposed to go after just everything that we've been praying to god for you know he's he's doing it right now like he's literally dropped the rain hence why my hair is all wet and looking weird <laughs> and uh he's doing it right now and um this is just a confirmation like i kept when i was driving down the road the day that i saw this i was coming back from a, an appointment or something and i kept seeing semis that said dot like it was just like i'll try to find a photo of it but it was just you know, D-O-T, dot, it was just a, a big blue dot and had the word dot in it. And it's dot foods. Uh, I don't know if it must be a name brand of some kind or something. But anyways, I saw like two of them, which is double. So God is going to be giving double for our trouble, double portions. Um, you know, when you think about connect the dots, you know, it's to make sense. It's to fill in the gaps and the voids and it's to basically bring something to completion to where it draws out a picture and that's what this is it's a picture and it's just basically it's a hat and you know god even says he's going to be giving us a crown you know he's going he's going to when he takes us from glory to glory we get a crown and there's so many like messages in this so sorry guys i hope you all can keep up and then the last thing that he wanted me to share with you about this I should just probably hold on to it <laughs> is if you notice, this really is done by a child. I don't have any children. And this child's name is Rose, which is cute. That's a nice name. And uh, yeah, it's a little snowman. Like, I don't know. I honestly don't know if this child like just really likes Christmas or how long this has been, but it got tossed out and it got blown in my yard somehow. I don't know. 
that is the most supernatural thing. And God was literally telling me something about connect the dots. And it used to be knocking dominoes and now it was connect the dots. And so when I saw this, I kind of was like, oh, I was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> like he's actually doing it. And the thing is about it is he wants us to have childlike faith. And that's why I brought up the child because it's like, it was literally done by a child and I don't have any. So it's like, <laughs> you know, you got to have childlike faith in order to believe God for what it is that he, that you've prayed to him about, or that he's told you he's going to do in your life. Like you just have to be able to walk in faith, not by sight and just really trust even when you don't know how to trust anyone else or what to hold on to or how to take that next step or what to do just know that you're going to be making super super progress when every time that you put your trust and your faith and your hope in Jesus Christ every time that you open your bible and every time that you pray every time that you are obedient and you do what it is that God's told you to do even if it's the most smallest step it's in the right direction and like as you can see there was like 10 different steps here. For this child, maybe it was a little difficult. As you can tell, she om she almost missed number four. She kind of went zigzag. And then number eight, she completely missed it, but not by much. There's still a small gap. But she still made it. She got all the way to 10. And now the picture is complete. So whatever that last thing is that you've been praying to God for, it's coming and it's already on its way. So... That could be a person, it could be a job, it could be restoration, it could be money, it could be whatever, like a financial breakthrough. Um, it could be anything that you've been praying for, okay? We're not trying to focus on the materialistic things here, but I'm just saying that God's going to, he's going to meet your needs. Like he knows what you're going to say or what you think before you even ask it. So just keep that in mind that he's got your back. Like he knows what it is that you've been begging and crying and praying for to him about this stuff so get excited because it is exciting he's connecting the dots he's doing it right now it is literally a matter of days weeks or maybe at the most a month at the most still take this up with god still check in with god you know ask him if this word is for you it more than likely is but if it's not when the time comes for you and you come across this video then it'll probably be your time if it's you know something that just pops up. Like I said, I have no control over who sees this, okay? I'm just doing what he told me to do, which is do this video and post it. So get excited because it's connecting the dots and God's doing his thing. And now all you need to do is just be still and wait for it to happen because it's happening. Anyways, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching, you know, any videos on my channel. Thank you if you're new here and this is your first time here. Again, my name is Miranda Hughes and don't forget to, you know, subscribe, hit that like button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos of mine. And if you're new and you're not sure if you really like my stuff, well, I have plenty of videos that you can watch. Some of them are short, some of them, most of them are actually pretty long, but I'm going to be getting better about that, so apologize guys. Thanks for bearing with me and also don't forget to walk in your worth. Bye guys. Love you.